Yo, what's up, guys? It's Tech Ram here, or you guys can call me Ram. But today, guys, I am back with another video. So, it's been a long while since I've made a video, and a lot of people were requesting that um, my most popular video, which is at 8k views currently, I'm not quite sure. And we're at, we're like basically at 100 subscri uh, subscribers. But yeah, so a lot of people were talking about it like not working. Their apps got revoked. And yeah, this video is going to be talking all about that. Also, if this doesn't work, then you guys have to use Nest Tool. And I know I made a bad, and I, and I know I made a video about Nest Tool saying that Nest Tool is bad. But if you guys are really desperate to get an anti revoke Nest Tool, you guys can use Nest Tool. But um, so specifically for me, it kind of like messed it up. But I don't know for you guys. So yeah, anyways. Let's get on into it. So first, what you guys are gonna go? You guys are gonna go to Safari, and once you guys go to Safari, sorry. Once you guys go to Safari, you guys are gonna go to iOS Emulator Spot. I'll leave the link in the description. And yeah, after that, you guys are gonna go to Select a Page. Sorry guys, but you guys are going to go to se select a page and go to iOS tools. After you guys are to uh, after you guys are at iOS tools, you have to go all the way down to anti revoke profile. And you guys are going to hit either the first link or the second link. For me and a lot of other people, it worked for alternative link 2, but there was like one person who said it, uh, alternative link 1 worked. So then just do alternative link one, but for me, alternative link two worked. So you guys are gonna hit allow. And you guys are going to hit install. And you guys are gonna enter your passcode. Why not? And a lot of people are also asking about this, and this is harmless. It's just the same thing. It's just saying that do not get it from other places since other places may contain other stuff that can harm your device but i'm gonna hit next next and install then it automatically installed so for me after doing this my apps uh, uh they didn't get revoked but for a lot of people they said that it did get revoked so you guys are going to go to settings and you guys are going to go to VPN. And you guys are going to click on this. So look, for me, it says just check mark there. So it's going to work for me. But some people, they probably didn't have the check mark there. And even if they did have the check mark there and it doesn't work, then you guys are going to hit the little info button. And you guys are going to hit connect on demand. Basically, what that means is that every time your apps are going to get revoked anti-revoke the profile the server it will connect to the vpn and then it would like it would just stop the revoke and your apps will completely stay there and without any revoke so this is one of the ways to do it and for my cousin like one of my other cousins um this happened and it and after i did this it was perfectly fine and their apps from a tweakbox app we're not revoked so yeah anyways then we are going to do the second thing so you guys are going to go to tweak box and it might take a while uh you guys just have to search up on safari tweak box app and then after that after doing tweak box app it's gonna say install and then yeah so anyways you guys are gonna go to apps Wait up. I'm gonna go back here. And I'm gonna go to apps. And they just give you an ad like this because yeah, anyways. You guys are gonna go to tweak box apps and just scroll down all the way until you see an app called No Thanks. You guys are gonna click on this click install and install 
So, a lot of people are saying that this didn't work. So, if this doesn't work anyways, then what you guys can do is you guys can do the first method that I told you guys about in the start, which is connect on demand. And that, for me, certainly works. So, yeah, that's why um, I did that. But, yeah. So, and after that, you guys are going to wait till it downloads. Oh, it doesn't install. Wait, let me just delete this and try again. I don't know why, because before this, I've actually made it, I actually told people that it worked. I even have footage, so I might just play that footage, because I already know um, what happened. So, yeah, but I'm trying to get this video as fast as possible. So, yeah, that's why. And, yeah, if it doesn't work, then you guys can use the first method for me now. I think, for me now, I especially think that it will work for you. But for me, currently on the latest firmware, no thanks will not work. But for like the early versions of iOS 12, it will most definitely work. So anyways guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, leave a like and subscribe for more news and tech tips. But yeah, also I'll be making a new video on my 100 subscribers special i think we're at 98 subscribers right now so if you can if you guys can please subscribe to my channel it's free why would you not do it and also if you guys want you guys can like this video and share with your other friends also i'll be making a new video on how to get nest tool so if you guys go on to nest tool it's just a bunch uh, it's, it's just a white page and just telling you like um to click some random links and stuff